Welcome back to the tenants. Today we're gonna to be making a bunch of money. At least that's what I hope. So the tenant that I got into our house last time has since left. So this time I'm gonna begin an open house and we're gonna advertise the rooms to rent because we have four bedrooms so we can get four different tenants and hopefully make way more money. Apparently this lease of 10,000 can count over the whole place, not just one person. So I think we should be okay. Well, let's find out. All right, so we're advertising now. We just gotta hope that these people coming in actually like the place. I haven't done any additional renovations yet to make it nicer, but we'll see how we go. So you guys also suggested 80% is usually a good place to go. So let's make an offer, okay. Okay, a little bit lower. Yeah, there we go. So 2612 for a four square meter room and we'll go 120 days. We'll just get him locked in. All right, so we got one tenant. You look pretty happy. So I'm gonna negotiate right away. Let's go to the six square meter room, 2655. What, that's my profit. Oh, I gotta unpause. Okay, all right, all right, I'll, I'll, I'll play, I'll play ball. I'll go a little lower. All right, that's fine, 2653. 120 days, get in here. Who's next? 27, yes, accept, thank you, welcome. Finally, someone that understands the beauty of this place. All right, negotiate, come on. I don't I don't think there's anyone that's gonna pay over 2,000, which really sucks. Cause that means we're gonna have to do this and then I'll just lock him in for a few months. All right, whatever, let's accept that and just, let's just end this. this I've spent 20 minutes just getting tenants here. So we're still working on the lease with a thousand, rent over a thousand, because this place is currently 7,700, four tenants though. And this one's 7,000 with one tenant. So we can definitely do better. We just need to make this place nicer. So I need a bit more money. So what's a job that pays well? That's easy. This one looks pretty easy. Let's do it. I don't know what it is, but let's go do it. Clean up the apartment. Okay, cool. So we're making like a laundromat. Sweet. Let's do the old cleany cleany and cleaned and scrubbed and brushed and blasted and uh, I don't know, sponged? I don't know what he did there. Restore, so hopefully we can get this free uh, washing machine. That'd be good. Yeah, there we go, sweet. All right, let's exit here and then start the renovation. Okie dokie. So they need a waiting room and, oh, wait, what? The waiting room is the, okay, no, never mind. They just need one room. They want some big plants out here. Okay, uh, and then four garden decorations. What is this, red candle? There you go, beautiful. It's a oh, decoration, 100%. Okay, walls, red. You got it, boss. Floor, concrete. I feel like it's already concrete, but I guess I'll put more concrete on top. Damn, what a good laundromat this is. Oh, thousand dollar couches, heck yeah. Oh, 100%, there you go. Boom, look at this place. They're gonna love this. <laughs> yeah, they love it. <laughs> yeah, there we go. 28,000 bucks. So our loan is still $244,000. <laughs> so if I wanna pay it off early, it's a lot of money. Now I was told occasionally this place comes up to say, oh, I need to be a higher level. I guess I need to do this first. $10,000 in rent. See, I kind of wish I had not, um, I shouldn't have locked him in for 120 days because it means I can't edit this lot at all until they're all left. None of them are that happy. What's wrong with you guys? Be happy, please. Maybe it's because they're all combining into one horrific hydra headed creature. I think your tenants started to cook. M oh, ah, hmm. Maybe I should background check them. I'll call, yeah, I'll call the cops. I'm not. I'm not involved in this. Is it because they're wearing that outfit? Yeah. Uh, are you just doing it right on the dining table? So you called the cops on me, I'll remember that. Well, remember that in prison, buddy, because you're, you're a... Well, I mean, he was an alcoholic mobster. All right, well, maybe I'll let this house empty out and then we can renovate. Two of the tenants have left. One was arrested and the other one, the uh, lease expired. What I'm going to do now is actually manually terminate the agreement, the lease agreement. So we will have to pay money for it, but I think it's worth it. What, it was a true nightmare living here. This place, this place is amazing. I mean, yes, someone was doing things they shouldn't have been, but that's not my fault. I got them arrested, so it's fine. I wonder if I could make the bedrooms bigger. Maybe that will help us out a little bit. Cause if we move like this piano, for example, I mean, not ideal, but let's put it right at the front door. Cause I want to move this wall out to here so we can fit all that in. So we're going to go build wall here, go door and door. Yeah, so we got all this extra space now. Yeah, nice, that'll be good. Thousand dollar doors, thank you. Let's upgrade those. So let's work on the living room. That's a score of B. Maybe we need to get some, get a Mona Lisa in here maybe. I've got a nice expensive armchair too. And a lamp, yeah. Oh yeah, I gotta fix the kitchen as well. Let's uh, put the fridge over here on the side instead. Yeah, there you go. And the wine rack, I guess, is over here. Oh, that blocks this. Is that okay? 
Yeah, there we go. That's fine. We also got a sweet beanbag armchair. Let's get that in here. Let's get that in one of the bedrooms, actually. Does someone want... Oh, we can put a slide in the garden. Maybe they'll like that. Got a dresser with a mirror, so I'm going to add that into here. What toilet is this? Is that the best toilet? It looks like it is. Okay, just making sure. Oh, we should get a hammock in the garden. Oh, we can get a bigger pool now. It's still... That made no difference. I put a big pool in here. Maybe we need to get rid of some of these. We have a crappy grill. Maybe we need a better grill. Maybe we need this. 19. <laughs> This garden is so ugly. It's still a like, I don't know, man. There's like really nothing you can do to it. All right, well, let's focus on the bedrooms. Let's get some like plants and stuff in here because plants are usually a pretty easy way to uh, up the rating. The living room is A. I want each, I want every room to be at least an A, I think. The bathroom is an A, that's good. This bedroom is also B and this one's B. So the problem is we're not gonna get the gardens to be an A. There's just, I don't think there's any way to do that. It's crazy. Right, this room is A now as well, since I filled out that bookcase. This room, what could we put in here? They've already got a mirror. Maybe a nice big vase. They go A75 though. Maybe they could use like a couch or something in here. That actually made it worse. Okay. <laughs> Maybe another Mona Lisa. 93, there you go. <laughs> okay, this one's 90, that's good. The bathroom is 102, which is amazing. The living room is also 81, which is still an A, A rating. 90, yeah! 74 and 73. So we're gonna get these two rooms to be a little bit better. 90 in that room, great. Then this room just needs a little bit of a booster. 92, yeah, there we go. So we got 92 in this room, 90 in that bedroom. The living room is 90 as well. Bathroom 102. This bedroom is 90. This one is 93 and the garden is atrocious. I think I, I might just have to maybe just gut them and start again at some point. But let's let's try this for now. Let's end this because this should hopefully be a lot better to begin an open house with. So radio rooms to rent. So there's one room that's a bit smaller than all the others, but it's okay. It's just this one. So hopefully this all works out. Why do they go to the garden first? The garden's the worst. Stop going to the garden. The garden sucks. Okay, so far actually everyone loves this place. So let me just run checks on all three of these people. So let's go about 3,400. Oh, I gotta unpause. I always forget about that. We need them to be above 2,500 for every room, which you are. So 120, you're in. Welcome. Now you as well, negotiate. Now you got a bigger room, so this one could be better. Let's go make an offer here at 3,500. 26. There's still, there's still a profit. They're still gonna hit 10,000. 2,800. You're in, welcome. You love room seven, hang on, maybe. Ah, here we go, so there is someone that is willing to pay a little bit more cashola. All right, a little bit more. I'll take it. Wait, who are you again? Walter Reynolds. No tenancy history, but do you have a criminal record? I didn't check that. No, you're good, you just have a bunch of debt, okay. <laughs> That's fine. If we say 2520, not bad. Okay, a little bit higher, please. 2300, there you go, 2110. So that should, be the 10,000, right? Also, yeah, the TV's broken, I'll, I'll fix that. Hey! Okay, so I guess that was not true about it could be any number of tenants because we have 10,052 in rent from this lease. Um, so I guess it needs to be one lease, not one house. Oh, okay. Siri here, let me know if I can help. Siri, you cannot help right now. I just spent like an hour trying to get four tenants to get $10,000 and it's not even what we need. All right, well, I guess if that's the case, let's, uh, let's do some jobs because we're gonna need to make, oh wow, these jobs suck. I need more money than this. All right, well, let's go. Accept, accept, accept. Oh, I can only do two, all right. It's time to get real. Here we go. Walls, yellow, floor. Concrete, shelf, shelf, workshop equipment, tires, bike rack, workbench, done. Boom, decor, 100%. Deliver, let's go. Now you better be like, oh yeah. You better be like, oh yeah. See, this is what I call a landlord. Oh, weeb set. <laughs> cool, five stars, bonus 480. Beautiful, let's go to the next one. Let's go, walls, jungle, carpet, Green, audio system, on the floor. Oh, actually, they also want speakers. Okay, fine. For speakers, speakers. They want an armchair to listen to it. There you go, boom, let's go. I think we did what we needed to. Ah, 9,600, that's better. And 8,900, let's accept both of those. All right, so let's begin the renovation. So it looks like we're doing a gym and it's just one big room, which is super easy. So we go jungle, concrete. Uh, I mean, look, it's not the best, whatever, I guess. All right, well, I'll leave you to that. I'm gonna jump over to this one. All right, let's first of all fix the grass out back and then out front. Oh, I actually don't care about the front or the back. They're only caring about the living room. Oh, we're getting a few dance poles up in this place. Let's go. Plants. And grandfather clocks is always the way to go. 
and maybe a Mona Lisa or two. There you go, 92%, that'll do. But check out my sweet, sweet garden. You gotta love this. Oh yeah. All right, let's see what we got for this one. Five stars, dang, that's so good. Oh yes, they're loving it. Eh, they, that's okay. All right, bonus 3,500. Dang, five stars across the board. All right, well I got 36 grand, which is not really enough for anything. <laughs> what am I gonna do with that? How much is this? Five, okay, that's 500. <gasps> Wait, I can buy the treehouse now. Oh, that's our goal. That's our goal today. We're gonna buy this, 108. Quick, I gotta do more jobs. All right, you just want the bathroom done, so that's easy. All right, so finish walls, gray. That's not the bathroom, where am I? Gray, floor, stone, decor, 100%, done. Deliver. Now the other one, this one, oh, this is a big job. All right, well, this one, I'm definitely just gonna do as little as possible. <laughs> Cause you can, you could spend easy like an hour on this job, but I'm just gonna, we're just gonna do what they need and get out. All right, let's check on how uh, the other one, the review was going. Oh, they're loving it. Yes, that looks like it's good. So I think this one was smashed out of the park. We do have rats over there, but I sent someone in, it's fine. Five stars, bonus, beautiful. Look at this, 42,000. The problem is I think we're gonna have to pay the loan back soon. Well, not all of it, but we're gonna have to pay 15,000 soon for the loan, so we're gonna lose a lot of money. Anyway, let's do this, let's go. All right, so I gotta do four rooms. So we're gonna do a bathroom. We've done this job before, so it's kind of gonna be the same. So we're gonna go, bathroom can go there, and then we need a kitchen as well, don't we? So this will be our kitchen. This can be the bedroom, and then this is the living room. And I think this is actually a better layout than I did last time, so kitchen. Uh, bathroom, bedroom, living room. The so kitchen's done. <laughs> I just put all the expensive stuff in there. Deco, 100% though. Boom. Bathroom is done. Looking stunning at 100%. Right, Deco, 100%. Beautiful. And then the living room. Living room, 100%. <laughs> Look at this room. <laughs> it's fine though. That's all we need. All right, workshop. Brown, concrete, workshop, 100%. All right, garden now. All right, so that's everything. Oh, look at this, all 100%. I feel like this is easier than the last time we did this place. And then I need a desk lamp as an optional thing that they would like. One of these babies. There you go. Give me the money. I have two messages. Uh, cool, solved your problem and you sent me some overdue money. Cool. I've not really been keeping up with that. So I just assume everyone's paying their rent and 4,000. Right, so this place needs Bathroom, bedroom, and a living room. Okay, that's pretty straightforward. So bathroom, bedroom, living room. The bathroom doesn't need much in it, so we could just do a small bathroom like this, I think would be good. A door and door. All right, we've got a pretty modest budget, so let's not go too crazy on doors. Maybe 200 bucks. We'll get the curtains in. <laughs> so yellow in the bathroom. Beautiful tiles. There you go. <laughs> that's such an ugly room. Next, uh, we got the bedroom. Get the bricks, because apparently they, they like brown. That's the most expensive one, so I always just do that. Wait, what? They don't mind the required furniture we're putting in, so it doesn't actually matter the quality of this furniture. I guess just the decor is going to matter. So let's choose some cheaper things then. Ooh, it's only 5%. Well, we'll come back to that, because we definitely want that to look a bit nicer. Right, the living room. Beautiful yellow walls. Nice green carpet. Oh, yeah. The, I think... Is this the job we did before? Yeah, where a lot of our budget went to these items. Couch or armchair. And, but they don't mind the items, so that's why I'm going real cheap on it. But some of these things, like the arcade machine is super expensive and pinball machine. So we've got everything we need. The decor is really low. We do need a wall clock though. So let's just up the decor. Because we've got, we've got still $3,000, so I think we should actually be fine. Oh, we've got a review. What do we, how do we do? How do we do? Yeah, 13 grand. Beautiful. Oh, let's get a Christmas tree. That's fun. We need a grandfather clock. Mona Lisa. That's a classic. 100%. Look at that. 85. All right, I'm happy with that. We've got 72 bucks left. All right, let's deliver this job. Well, we'll see how that goes. And let's jump over to this one now. We're just rattling off these jobs as quick as possible because I need that 100 grand to get that sweet, sweet tree house. All right, this is good. <laughs> Well, good is subjective. I did what they asked for and the game doesn't know how to tell what's actually good or not. All right, what else do we have? Oh, these are all like cheapo jobs that don't pay that much. It's so annoying. Uh Oh, can you believe it? When I was at work, someone broke into my apartment. Oh man. All right. Yeah, I'll get some cameras in there. Sure. Why not? I want you guys to like me. All right. Well, let's do a couple of rooms. Cause they're pretty quick and easy. We're gonna do, do a workshop. I got some new like wooden walls now too, which is nice. Same old stone floor. We've done this one before. You guys know the drill. A statue, you don't want a $3,500 statue in here? Why? <laughs> Look, if I can't afford to do this renovation, it's their own fault. You want another barrel, okay. And a bike rack. Right. Oh yeah, job's done, sweet. Lawn mower, okay. There you go, 100%. Let's go. I think that's all I need to do. Let's just deliver that. Next one, equipment failure. Wait, what's this? Oh, at my place? I just want a new fridge. Okay, I can get a new one. There you go, guys. 
that all? So the last job was four stars. I mean, that's all right. So they just want me to do this workshop. Okay, I can do this. So they don't mind the preferred furniture in this one. So we'll just do cheapo crap. Oh, lathe. Oh, that's sick. There's like actual workshop stuff in here. Fire extinguisher. That makes sense. First aid kit. Oh, this just goes on the, I got put on the table. And another chair. All right, you can have one over here. There you go. So they don't mind the required furniture. They just want some nice decor. All right, well, I'll get you a couple plants in here. That, that usually solves the problem, right? Oh, that's only 31%. Hmm. Maybe a Mona Lisa would help. Oh, I can't afford a Mona Lisa. What about this one? 30, oh, these are really not helping. <laughs> so none of those items really helped. Okay. Maybe they want some more stuff like... What about this? That didn't do anything. All right. What about this? That also didn't do anything. Man, they what, what do they want in this room? Wait, I can afford a Mona Lisa now that I sold the other stuff. So let's get this. That didn't, they don't care about the Mona Lisa? All right, well, fine. I'll just leave it then. <laughs> Whatever. All right, so it's $74,000. All right. Last job was $22,50. There's no bonus payment on that though. That's a problem. Any better jobs? No, these all suck still. Like they're not paying that much money. They seemed okay with that place. I think they didn't mind it. Oh no, in a few days, we're gonna lose another 15 grand to this stupid bank. Yep, there it goes. We're back down to 60,000. Oh! Oh, we have an earthquake. Let's go. Cool, we've got an $8,000 job now, which is a little bit better. That'll pay a bit more money. All right, this one's done. This is supposed to be a library, um, but they didn't actually require that many books. So it's a little empty, but uh, they also didn't mind what furniture I put in. So it's all really crappy, cheap furniture, but that's what they wanted. So all done. Ooh, $9,000 job. Yes, please. Oh, hang on. I've got I've to take care of this tenant. Uh, I'll send a pro in for that. I ain't doing it. I got a renovation to take care of. We are close ish to a hundred thousand. I still 20,000 off, but we're getting there. I just got to grind out these jobs by the sweet tree house and it's going to be awesome. All right. So I now have 123,000 after doing a bunch of jobs. Is that a uh, tree house? Oh good. It's still for sale. I wasn't sure if it still would be. Oh, it's only 115 now. Oh wait, no, it was 108 before. So it's more expensive. Oh, well, let's buy it. I thought it would. I've done so many nice renovations here and this is the state that I receive it in. Are you kidding me? All right. Well, let's restore it. Also, I've got to pay the bank in a couple of days and I don't have <laughs> I don't have enough cash. So I don't know how that's going to go down. Uh oh, wait, what's happened here? Um, I think your tenant started to cook. OK, wait, which which one again, guys? Do we really have to have, have this problem again? Really? <sighs> It was the game of this. Don't we have a mobster living here? All right, well, let's call the cops on that guy. We, 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 we cannot have that in here. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's uh, that's a problem. All right, off you go. <laughs> All right, can I? Uh, OK, no, they're still here. Oh, that person's really happy with this place. I also only have $1,700 because I think I just paid the bank. So I did have enough money, which is good. Yeah, I called the cops on you. Well, I mean, of course I did. I'm not leaving you to do that in my my house. All right, we got a new tenant sorted. We got $8,900. Got to pay some bills. Let's go to my new tree house. <laughs> yeah, all right. So this, uh, we need to be able to rent this. Um, do we bother even building any walls and trying to do a bathroom or do we just have it in one room? Because I mean, I don't see how this could work. I mean, we could do a bathroom here. So if we move the little electrical wall unit over there, put it in a door. I mean, I've only got $7,000, so this actually cannot be that expensive. And this little love heart door there. We have a free shower that I collected on one of my jobs. We can chuck this in. And I also have a washing machine too. Hang on, they can't access this. Uh-oh, I'll talk to them, don't worry. Let's have a fancy antique desk and all that. So what do we actually need? We need a seat and a fridge. Oh, and a bed. We need a toilet. Okay, well, let's go with this one, 450 for now. Because that's kind of all I can afford. Oh, I can't get to the shower. Hmm. There's a lot of windows in here, which is kind of the problem. Hang on, let me put the toilet here for a second. Move. I, I'm just putting this washing machine in here, hopefully to get a little bit of a higher rating. There you go. Okay, bathroom. A sink would be nice. Oh, damn, I just lost a lot of money on that. We could probably fit this in. Hang on, let me move this. Oh, damn. Hang on, this can work. This can work. This can work. Okay, put the, <laughs> this here. Move the shower here. Toilet. Oh, damn. Oh, wait, we can do the thing where we slide this really far into the corner, but they can still access it. Oh, but the stupid toilet has the... <laughs> Because the windows are there and the toilet has a thing above it. I can't place it. Oh wait, they can't access the shower now? Or is it just because the toilet? Hang on, let me move that. Oh yeah, it's just... Yeah, so that does work. And then I really just need this to fit in anywhere. It's a real shame that... Oh, I have to sell that toilet and lose a bunch of money on it. I am just have to get this one because this one will fit underneath. I mean, look at this room. I mean, it's a C score. That's pretty good. The fancy tiles, the fancy wall tiles. Look at this. 
How's that now? Hey, that's a good bathroom. It actually turned out really well. Oh, actually, can I fit this? I might be able to fit this in as well. I totally forgot about this. Hang on. Move the hamper. Put this here. Yeah, there you go. Look at this. And we can get this right there. Look at that. That's actually pretty amazing that that all fits in. 124. Now, this room probably won't be as good. So I need a bed, which I guess I'm going to have to do a single bed. I don't think we're going to be able to fit more than that. Which maybe I'll do here, kind of by the front door. Kind of annoying. I'll move the panel, of course. And then opposite the bed, we could have like a TV, maybe on a couple of these things. There you go, TV. Maybe we do like an armchair, pretty ugly armchair, but it counts. A little coffee table. Look at that, that is, that's pretty nice. Then we need to do like a little kitchen area. Go hardwood floors, yeah, nice. Really nice fridge. I'll move the fridge, hang on. I'll put the fridge here. Stove can go back where it was, or back where the fridge was. Then we'll get a nice, counter and the matching sink. And the fridge can just go over this side. So it's like a little bit just over here. This room is A right now, that's beautiful. I mean, we don't really need to do anything else. We'll do some stuff outside here as well because we can use this space. Oh, well, I have no money, so it's E. Well, well actually, hang on, what do I have in here? Can I put this out here? Oh yes, C. And a treadmill, can that go out here? Still C, come on, that's awesome. What about a rock climbing wall then? Oh, that has to go inside. I can put it inside. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, that's pretty good. It's C outside, not the best, but it's still pretty good. All right, so let's finish this. So we got our beautiful tree house. I mean, that's pretty good for a tree house. Let's begin. Oh, wait, I have no money to begin an open house. <laughs> All right, I might have to fast forward to get a bit of money here. All right, I got 700 bucks. <laughs> let's begin open house. We're just gonna get newspapers. Um, yeah, whole apartment because there's nothing else. So let's do that. And then also I've got a situation on my hands. I'll send a pro in. There you go. Problem solved. Oh, oh, why did you go to the balcony first? The inside's the nice bit. Okay, she's looking at the exercise thing. She's a gamer and a barman. Oh, unsatisfying? Okay, well. About you. Looking at the rock wall, that's pretty, oh, it's pretty cool. I mean, you can't really climb. Oh, they love it. They absolutely love it. An alcoholic butcher. Also, I just spent all my money on this one person, so I'm hoping that they are good. Okay, let's have a look. No criminal record, that's a start. No tenancy history, not ideal, but that'll that'll do. They love the apartment. So let's go suggest 5,900. They wanna pay 4,300, that's still pretty good. We'll go a little bit higher, maybe 5,200. 4,812, let's accept that offer for this tree house. I mean, they must really love living in a tree house. Welcome! Hey, thank you for coming. Uh, I was wondering if you could upgrade. Sure, I'll upgrade. I don't know, what else. All right, so now we have, we're making 15,000 for this entire, for the suburbs area between this property and the other house. So that's pretty good. It still says we're making minus 2,000 because we're repaying the loan. But that for some reason, I don't know why it doesn't, but it doesn't include the income we're getting from here, uh, which, how do I see it again? Oh yeah, at the top right. So we're getting 12,000 from here and 13,000 from here, so overall 25,000. So we're making about 10,000 a month at the moment with the loan repayments. So overall, pretty good. But man, I've been playing for like two hours today, like maybe two and a half or so, I think, because the game is at the point where it's actually getting really grindy to get money. And I did notice this in the last few parts, I, I cut a lot of it out. And those of you that have been playing have also noticed it. So I don't think we'll do too much more of the tenants for now. We'll do one more episode because I want to get to the next area. So that means I'll probably just do a lot of playing off screen to grind up some money and all that. Uh, but after that, we'll probably end it up for now. And then in the future, when there's more updates to the games and new things that have been added, we'll revisit it. So that's the plan. So look forward to the next episode of the new area. But thank you so much for watching. Make sure to leave your comments, suggestions and feedback down below. I'll see you next time and have an awesome day.